now at 11. We are not hindered in moving forward with our mission to proclaim the gospel. The message to vandals after four churches on Thomasville Road were damaged this week. Tallahassee police are investigating who did it. Now, this map shows all of the churches that were hit. ABC 27's Christian Thomas talks to them about what happened and what's next for them. I got a call about 6 a.m. saying that our church had been vandalized. Larry Perry, lead pastor of Freedom Church on Thomasville Road, says that call Tuesday was unexpected. When he got to the church, he found this. The wall behind me is where the uh, scripture was written, and it wasn't written very well. It was all chaotic. This marks the second time the church had been targeted in two years. They tried to burn our church down, burnt part of our lobby up. Perry is grateful this time they just needed a coat of paint. Freedom Church, Thomasville Road Baptist Church, and Good Shepherd Catholic Church were all able to cover up the vandalism. St. Peter's Anglican Cathedral is still working on a solution with X's and parts of scripture spray painted on the front of their building. There are people out there that do foolish things like this all the time. Now the cathedral is looking for someone to help remove the graffiti. Leaders are encouraging members to pray for the people behind this, even finding a bright side. There are uh, many X's in addition to some of the scribbles, and uh, I like to say that where the Holy Spirit is alive, X marks the spot. Now they're asking other people to be aware of what's happening in your communities. Let's be good neighbors to one another. So more damage isn't done. In Tallahassee, Christian Thomas, ABC 27. Police ask anyone who may have seen anything to contact them as soon as possible. And that contact information is on our website, WTXL.TV.